Loretta Lynn's death curse strikes again. Welcome to the Holly Fake Entertainment Channel. Country queen Loretta Lynn is devastated after a death curse looming over her struck again when a beloved family ranch foreman Wayne Spears was swept away by raging Tennessee floods. Spears is the fifth victim to be taken by the hex that's blamed for the deaths of the songbird's hubby, Doolittle, daughter, Betty Sue, son, Jack, and his farmhand son, Jeffrey. So much tragedy, so much grief. Now, Spears, carried away by the raging storm, says an insider a lot of people believe Loretta's cursed. Spears was among at least 16 killed after 17 inches of rain fell in just 24 hours, engulfing Loretta's home, Hurricane Mills, and surrounding areas with raging water on August 21st. The foreman was checking on animals in the ranch's barn when the fast-rising waters collapsed the building. Gripped by the powerful current, he was swept away and drowned. The heartbroken singer notes that while the ranch will be rebuilt, only God could rebuild a man like Wayne Spears. That's just no replacing that. As an insider, Spears wasn't just her ranch boss. He was a dear friend and died trying to make sure the ranch animals were safe. That breaks Loretta's heart. She's inconsolable. Now the beloved foreman's death is being blamed on a death curse that seems to be haunting the coal miner's daughter. In 1984, Loretta's eldest son, Jack, died at a premature age of 34. He'd been riding his horse alone when he tried to cross a river on the property, fell, and drowned. Loretta's husband of 48 years, Oliver Doolittle Lynn, passed away at the age of 69 from diabetes-related health problems and heart failure in 1996. He'd previously had both legs amputated following complications from heart surgery, and she had put her career aside to take care of him to the end. The singer's eldest daughter, Betty Sue, died from complications of emphysema in 2013. Then, in 2016, Jack's son Jeffrey died suddenly at the age of 47. No cause was given at the time. Her family's deaths have become part of the eerie legends surrounding Hurricane Mills, leading to the local buzz about a curse. The spooky mansion that crowns a hill where Loretta lived until a few years ago was the site of a bloody Civil War battle where 19 Confederates are said to be buried on the grounds. Friends say Loretta's seen their ghosts wandering around day and night. An earlier legend claims that Native American burial grounds were once located on Loretta's 3,000-acre ranch and dug up by treasure seekers in the 1800s as the town grew and was developed. Many believe that Loretta and her loved ones have inherited the curse for disturbing sacred Native American burial grounds, spills the insider. Her creaky old mansion is now a museum and the precious Native American artifacts are on display for the hundreds of gawking fans that visit every year and would be considered an insult to tribe members. Now her foreman's death is blamed on the curse. Loretta's lived through so many tragedies over the years and they can't all be coincidences, the insider says. This devastating flood is a harsh reminder that the curse continues. How about you? Do you think there's a curse on Loretta Lynn? Let us know what you think and we can discuss. If you think the video is good, please give us a like and share it with your friends. We will constantly update the latest news in the next videos. Please subscribe to the channel so you don't miss it. Thank you and goodbye.